Hello guys, it is Briggsy Boy, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another match day vlog for you guys to sit back and enjoy. So it's a little bit different today. Morecambe FC is who we are focusing on and they have got the close away game against Bolton Wanderers. Now it is the makings of a really good match. Uh, first things first, taking a look at the league table. Morecambe is we know struggling this season. And you know, we did expect that really. They are the underdogs currently sitting in 21st place or the last spot in the relegation zone. Uh, and they're on 31 points, so every game is crucial now, uh, with about 11 or 12 left for them. Every game, absolutely massive. Uh, as for Bolton, been on a really good streak at the moment, scoring plenty of goals. They are 11th on 54 points, so they're pushing towards that top half of the table. The team's just outside the playoff area. So again, every game is massive for them. Can they have a late surge on this season and maybe get a spot in the playoffs? Um, Morecambe's last result, it was a 2-0 loss away uh, to Plymouth Argyle. The form in the last five matches for the Shrimps, they have won none. The last win coming uh, 22nd of January, it was now, so you know a long time ago. They've drawn two and they've lost three. As for Bolton, their last result was a 3-0 win away at Gillingham. And the form the last five games for Bolton, they've won three, drawn none and lost two. Bolton are a high-scoring team at the moment. I look at the results, they're scoring three, four, most games. They've absolutely battered some teams this season. So you never know what is going to happen against them. But hopefully, it should be an entertaining game. Uh, my score prediction for today could go one or two ways, really. Bolton could steamroll Morecambe, or it could be a really close, a really tight game. <sighs> you know, as I say, it's a difficult one to predict, but I'm going to say a Morecambe 1-0 win. Scrappy game, but we're going to get there uh, and hopefully pick up some points on our travels. But yeah, believe it or not, it's my first visit to Bolton's ground, even though it's such a close stadium. Looking forward to it. Should be a really good match. But yeah, let's crack on with the video. Come on, you shrimps.
paraphrase that question again. It looked like you were going to get three points. You only got one. How do you feel about the performance and the outcome? Yeah, the performance was excellent tonight. You know, I thought that um, we played really well tonight. We created some really good openings. Uh, you know, I thought that uh, it was a strong performance from the whole team tonight. You know, defensively, we limited Bolton Wanderers to very few opportunities and uh, we created some really big moments in the game and uh, I think that you know the goal that you know Cole Stockton got was you know from our press from Adam Phillips uh, who was magnificent on the night Connolly you know ran his socks off and so did you know the three players in midfield Stockton up front and the, you know the, the defenders as well showed really good shape and uh, you know we should have gone two and a little ahead um, you know we had a number of chances but we've had a stone wall penalty kick not given it 1-0 and um, I think that you know over the night um, I think that the referee um, has to see that it is a penalty kick he doesn't give it the lines one on the side doesn't give it and uh, you know I don't know if they thought they had to send a player off because he was sliding in and you know it's a it's it's a really bad challenge from their player and uh, you know Connolly is in full momentum takes the ball past him and gets wiped out and I don't understand why you know the penalty you know hasn't been given but in the end um, you know we've we've taken a point we've got you know a lot of decisions didn't go for us tonight I think that um, I thought the boat bonder has got a lot of decisions going their way as far as Cole Stockton's concerned, obviously the top scorer, he's got so many this season. He's gone a few games without scoring. Is that important for him to get back on the score sheet and, and get some sort of return, get a point for it? Yeah, I mean, he's always going to score goals because we create chances for him. And, uh, you know, he you know, got a goal tonight. He's in the right place and uh, finished it well. And uh, he's always, you know, been a big player for us. But I thought, you know, the back line and in midfield and up front, uh, you know, were very, very good tonight.